<laughs> I can tell we're live. We're live. We are live. Good morning, everybody. Here we are back. I'm doing this by myself today. Um, it's, uh, I'll, I'll try to make it exciting. Unfortunately, it's, it's a coffee-less classy today. I got here and the coffee shop wasn't open. I got the prop. Like, I could carry this pink cup around that somebody found at the bike show. But I don't want to touch it because it's probably should... I probably should use some Purell, but I only have one hand. So good morning, everybody. It's good to see we're going to let people sort of roll in. Um, but yeah, so I'm doing this by myself. So what I figured I'd do is I would just wander around, um, give everybody, well, because here's the other thing. Nobody wants to look at my face that close after being at the Toronto Motorcycle Show for three days. Um, hotel living at its absolute finest, uh, letting the country kid loose in the city. Uh, it's been a, uh, it's been a fun, fun couple days so far and today's the big day. So, uh, but I figured I'd just give everybody a little walk around. Um, if there's any questions anybody has, fire them out. Uh, I'll do my best to sort of answer them and go from there. Um, yeah, we, we, I don't know how you turn this thing around. You guys are probably tired of looking at me. Look, zero. We're in the zero display. We're, that's where we're starting. That's where I'm hanging my hat all weekend. Um, but like I said, we're going to do a little walk around here in a second, but I figured I'd let some more people get on and that way I can uh, show, share some stories of the bike show and, and, uh, go from there. And, uh, hopefully I, Hey, morning, Dennis, morning, John. Good to see you guys or see you guys are watching. So, um, but yeah, ask some questions guys. I'm going to do a little bit of a walk around. I won't go too deep into it. Kind of stick into our corner. A couple things I want to, uh, say is, you know, I don't want to, uh, I don't want to sort of spoil the show for everybody, but I'm going to go over some little highlights that, that we sort of do. So, um, let's spin this thing around. Looks like we got a good chunk of people on right now. This, this is actually pretty funny. So this is where I'm hanging my hat. We're in the zero motorcycle display. We've got all, well, we've got all the actual electric motorcycles in the show. So that's the real popular FX. People really like these ones. Sort of a dirt bike. A lot of people with lots of property love to just fly around on those. This is sort of the new flagship Zero, the Adventure Touring, Adventure Touring Electric. That's pretty fun. This is the one I put all the demos on, the Zero SRF. Bobby, we will see you soon. Morning, Rick. Morning, Mike. Morning, Rhonda. Um, this FXE, this is sort of their little Supermoto Street Fighter. Guys, if you haven't had a chance to ride one of these, I've been telling this story over and over and over again. Hey, morning, Ann. Um, everybody knows that I'm a big, bad Harley dude. Sun Life Financials here for all your financial pl I, What the hell? I don't know, but they have a BMW in there, a nice BMW in their display. But yeah, with the Zeros, hey, you know what? They're not for everybody. I get it. But at the end of the day, they are a lot of fun to ride. And I was just talking to Vince from the Montreal Motorcycle Show. He said, well, you know, I don't want to come and try them because I am just tire kicking at this point in my life. And I said, we don't care. Just get on them and ride. Get on them and ride. This is a DS, a DSR. That was a real popular one too. Um, this is the Stasic. This is, this has been my entertainment for the weekend. So these things here, these are electric pedalless bikes for kids. Um, I have been watching kids crash all day yesterday. I have this little thing. They just go around here in a loop. And I got to tell you, it is the most adorable thing I've ever seen. Uh, they have, we have seen a, a minimum, minimum of 30 crashes. Like a minimum of 30. Like, uh, and only one crier. See that little post right over on the other side? Kid went right in between there. I got to tell you, kids are tough. Like these kids are tough. So, um, but anyway, let's go for a little wander here. I won't wander too far today. I know, uh, I, I actually, there's a link below. Hopefully you still get to watch the video. Uh, Haley was in Milwaukee last night. She was doing the, yeah, there's Royal Enfield. She was doing the, uh, Mama Tried motorcycle show, a big deal in Milwaukee, the motherland of, uh, motorcycles. Harley Davidson's there. Uh, Royal Enfield's there. She was in the halftime show. So if the video is still up, just go right to the halftime show. You can see Haley. She's ripping around the track. She got her 
signature sparkly helmet on there with, uh, uh, <laughs> she was slow. She was slow as hell. Uh, <laughs> she hadn't slept by the time she got there. So anyway, um, but yeah, let's do a quick, we did the thing on Royal last week. So we'll sort of breeze by them, but let's go in and say hi to Lionel and Bob. Here's our uh, Royal Enfield contingent. Good morning, everybody. There's thousands of people watching on Coffee with Classy right now. Uh, Lionel is the Canadian manager for Royal Enfield. How was the show yesterday? And Bob is Bob. Bob. You know Bob. Everybody knows Bob. So how was the show yesterday, boys? Excellent. Busy. busy Excellent. Crowded. Perfect. Very crowded. It's probably really crowded today. Um, which bike was everybody looking for yesterday? Everything. Everything? Yeah, some people were uh, sitting on all the bikes. Nice. Perfect. Yeah, that... Yeah, the one we don't have, everybody wants that one. Everybody wants what they can't have. But like I said, I was, I was mentioning earlier, this is a show, guys. Like, there's not going to be any high-pressure sales here. Um, everybody's just basically saying, hey, come sit on our bikes. Lots of people taking pictures of bikes. And uh, so if you want to see some things, um, this is actually the 350 Classic I didn't do last week. Um, thanks, guys. I know you were dying. You're both, like, backing up, like, get me off the camera as quick as you can. <laughs> So that was good, but I'll show you this one. This is the Royal Enfield we didn't show last week. This is the classic 350 in the Halcyon Gray. Beautiful motorcycle. And then the latest release. Oh, look at that line. I'm chasing you. The latest release is the Scram. So there's the Scram 411. It's actually a pretty fun little bike. It's got uh, smaller wheels, 17-inch wheels. A little more, uh, a, a little, a little cooler design than the classic Himalayan. So essentially, you can see it's very similar to this bike here. Himalayan, but again, I keep chasing you guys. And there's a couple more scrams there. So, is there anybody, anything anybody wants me to take them to see? Like we're already at the show now. So, Triumph is right across the hall from us. All right, GP, GP bikes is here. Full security. We're here before the show. The behind the scenes look. Look at this. Hey, how are you? Say hello to everybody in Classy Land. Um, yeah, we got the crack security. Somebody got in your security right there. <laughs> but GP's got a bunch of KTMs here. Um, all that fun stuff. Let's go check out the adventure section. There's some sport bikes. If you like to go fast, don't go fast on those. Shouldn't say there's no high pressure sales here. We all know Ben. He's here. <clears throat> but again, here's some nice adventure stuff. I uh, met these guys got from Turkana yesterday. They're looking to do some luggage on uh, different bikes but again like i said as we grow as a company we do more and more stuff there's the there's uh there's your bike for you jeff i know you're looking for the uh adventure harley davidson harley davidson's dipping their toe in every water now another ktm adventure bike look we got a nice little fake fire area a little ural this one comes with a guy in a yeah he's ready to rock and roll he's going to switzerland there's the KTM, another KTM adventure bike. This one here, we've got the, uh, there's our Himalayan. This one here, <clears throat> there's our Himalayan. We dressed it all up with bags. This was my last thing I forgot. But look at the great job Mike did on our poster. Unfortunately, it's black and white. Nobody here had a color printer. Just weird, just really, really weird. So anyway, but again, there's a Triumph. Oh. Anybody want to see a snow bike? Look at that seat. Woo! Anyway, that's pretty cool. A BMW with a uh, with a snow track on it. So, but again, guys, like you can see, the whole show's here. I don't want to give away the show either. You guys who are coming down, come on down. Uh, anybody who wants to know anything about it, just shoot us a message. Um, let's go over and have a look at the Hondas as well. Some really nice big displays here. Boys from KTM are all setting up. Say hi to everybody. There you go. There you go. <clears throat> and again, so you got the Honda display. Again, Honda was here doing their big video yesterday. So they do their... Oh, what the hell is this? Yeah, Trail 125. You know, you do see some cool little stuff here. <clears throat> Actually, let's go wandering towards the back. Uh, Harley's got a couple of the 120 bikes here as well. Um... Everybody's kind of setting up. I don't really want to get in everybody's face. Um, that thing there, look at this. This thing's so fast, you got to keep the tires warm. Woo! That'd be fun. 
So side by sides. Yeah, there's the Harley display guys. You can see in there a couple of the red bikes. I didn't really want to walk around the show, but I may as well. I won't. You know, you got to get a closer look. Come see those Harley. Actually, the Harley is a really nice display this year, guys. And uh, you know, there's a really cool customs. Let's go see these performance baggers in behind. There's the ST everybody loves. Uh, hey, how's it going? Good morning. <laughs> uh, the new Road Glide trike is here. So you know what? The Harley, Harley did a really good job bringing stuff nobody's seen before. That's the nice thing about this show as opposed to the last show. <clears throat> These guys from Original Garage Moto Parts, they've got some wicked looking baggers here too. So, and then here, I'll give you the back door sneak peek. We'll just sneak around the corner here. Those are the new Harley uh, 120s. There's that CVO that everybody called Goldwing, which is so unfair. That's a beautiful motorcycle. So, um, vintage road racing, old soul clothing. These guys here got some wicked bikes. I need to spend some time with them later. They've got some really awesome parts on these bikes. And you can tell these guys like to go fast. So, no, pretty awesome. So, we'll cut back through here. Um, I cut off big portions of the show here, guys. There's still there's still lots. It's not the biggest the show's ever been. It's probably very similar to the. Oh, oh look out, cops! Cops! Shh, it's the cops. Okay, we're okay. So, um, like I said, it's not the biggest show we've ever been to. Hey, you can go paintballing for just nine dollars a person. Uh, but it's nice to see people back again. Um, we'll skip the whole leather sections and everything. Um, pizza, pizza's here. And they make the best. No, they don't. They make garbage pizza. But at the end of the day, it's something to eat. And it's $9 slice day. So, you know, come on out. Uh, everything's cashless now. Um, the one thing, I do want to go back and check out the Clutch Society. Um, it, it's funny. I came in to grab my coffee with Classy this morning. And uh, Hey, good morning, Karen. Um, but anyway, no questions. Anybody want to know anything? There's 36 of you. Like, I, actually, I, I can actually see the comments today. Um, so Strider, I'm sure this one, this is where I've got some dirt bikes back here for everybody to try as well. I don't know what the Yamaha thing is, but it looks pretty awesome. Um, but this is the Clutch Society today. We'll do a quick walkthrough in here. This is the motorcycle section. Don't, it's a very inclusive society. They all look way cooler than all of us, but you know what? They, uh, they're, they're a good bunch of people in here, so. But I'm just going to sort of walk in and around. Oh, look at that. There's a cool little van there. Um, Crooked Clubhouse is here. Remember, we got the deal on Crooked Clubhouse back at the shop. Two for one. No, wait. Buy two, get one free. These are the new Crooked Clubhouse designs. I, mean, I saw Joe yesterday, the whole bit. So, some pretty nice bikes here, too. Ricky? Yeah, yeah thanks, Ricky. Absolutely. They did roll out the red carpet. So this is Dan. This is Dan's section here. He's sort of the brainchild behind the moto photo. Want to see what you can do with your classy chassis motorcycle? When, bought, when Dan bought this, he was riding a Sportster and traded it in on this road glide. He did the suspension with the piggybacks. Right, he went Owens. I disagree with him on that. He should have went. He should have went Legend, but he's got a nice Solomon seat on there some cool parts but yeah that classy chassis motorcycle is coming a long way that's 2011 he bought way back in 13 so morning guys say hello to everybody in classy land sorry i'm that guy walking around with the video <laughs> don't sue me for light rights or anything later <laughs> but <laughs> but some really awesome bikes here guys we're doing a little walk through before Morning, Deb. Morning, Troy. But yeah, just some really cool stuff in here. And again, we'll we'll cut right out. There's some more sections over there. But uh, anyway, guys, it's uh, great to see everybody. Oh, some nice art there too. So this has actually been kind of a fun show. You know, it's a it's an industry show. It's more of a show. It's not there's not a whole lot of high pressure sales here. It's just motor good motorcycle people getting together in downtown Toronto. Um, Honda's letting everybody know they're here. You know how many people see these trailers open? And, uh, yeah, we'll be back on Tuesday as normal, Dennis. 
for sure. Um, we're closed on Monday. Uh, oh, are we open? I think we are. I think we close. Charlene or Mike, you're going to have to look at the calendar, but I'm pretty sure we're, I'm there Tuesday. I miss you guys at the shop. We've been down here for a while. Oh, there we go. Here's the guys from MotorcycleCourse.com. Say, hey, Mike, say hi to everybody. Hello. There you go. We got you on Classy Land. Hey. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> we, got a, we got a professional racer right there running away from the camera. There's Mac Wheel Racing right there, guys. Look at his fancy new boot. Big bad motorcycle rider did it playing basketball. <laughs> Thanks, guys. Take care. All right. So... So anyway, that was pretty fun. I'm going to, uh, this coffee place hasn't even opened yet. So, um, but yeah, anyway, bring the kids out guys. You know what the coolest thing about this show is? There is so many bikes for you to bring kids here for family day weekend. Uh, people are running to this display right here. This is the Yamaha. This is your Yamaha let the kids crash day. Uh, <laughs> it's been uh, pretty awesome. These guys are the guys from Yamaha. Say hi to everybody in Classy Land, guys. All right, so come on out to the show. Bring your kids. This show is very family friendly. Uh, look at the Striders over here. Like I said, oh, these guys got jumps. Okay, I want them to have jumps next door to me. Okay, well, anyway, guys, I'm gonna let you guys go. Coffee place still hasn't opened yet. Um, but yeah, I, I just did a quick walk around the outside. Didn't go through the middle. It's not, like I said, it's not the biggest show in the world, but it is so good for the kids to get out and enjoy motorcycles. You gotta remember, this is gonna be a bigger scene than most people have seen in a long time. So, um, I'll just turn this around. Give everybody a big old, hi Stevie, hi Leia. Um, we're, we're going back to work now. We got to say hi to everybody we wanted to say hi to. Thank you for being on live and make sure you share and like this video. Um, I don't even know if that works, but yeah, just share it. Let everybody know this is what's going on. And uh, yeah, come on down. Uh, <sighs> yeah, you know what? Maybe later, a little later, I'll I'll just sit there and watch the kids crash because it's it's hilarious, man. And I'll tell you, the best part about it is they bounce. There's there's a thing about that. Those kids, they do bounce. Morning. <clears throat> so, um, but yeah, we're ready to rock and roll. Wish the coffee was open, but uh, we'll see you guys when you get here and uh hi stevie hi leia and uh hey you're welcome for the tour hey metal militia clothing you're welcome Rhonda, and uh we'll see you guys later thanks again and uh yeah so we're at the shop today too so if you're not coming down to the show uh mike's uh, mike's there oh wait a second there's my uh zero crew uh, oh sorry no just my zero crews how are you doing man long time no see Awesome. Good to see you. Say hi to everybody in Classy Land. This is Johnny the Rep. So I put him on. And he said, remember, you put me on a video before. And I was like, why did you do that? And I'm like, I just did it again. So anyway, back to selling motorcycles and we'll see you guys later.